Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Glory to your name, God. Hallelujah. Bless your name. Hallelujah. Bless your name, God. Hallelujah, bless your name, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, bless your name, God. Praise your name, God. Oh, we bless your name, we bless your name, we bless your name, we bless your name, God. Hallelujah, bless your name. Thank you, Jesus. We bless your name. Hallelujah. We bless your name. In the name, in the name, God. In your name, in your name, God. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, we bless your name. We thank you, Lord God. We worship you, Lord God. We give you honor, Lord God. I thank you, Jesus. This is the day, God, that you have made, Lord. And we rejoice, we rejoice, we rejoice, Lord. We praise your name, God. We worship your name, God. In the name, in the name, in your name, God. Oh, we bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name, Lord. Oh, we bless your name. In the name of Jesus. Come on, somebody. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. In your name, Jesus. Oh, we bless your name. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, we bless your name. We bless your name. Hallelujah. Oh, we bless your name. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Somebody help me bless the name of the Lord this afternoon. For the Lord God is great, and the Lord is greatly to be praised. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, we thank you. Father God, we honor you. Father, we just love you. Father God, we appreciate you. We just bless your name, God. We bless, we bless, we bless your name. We bless your name. Hallelujah. Oh, we bless your name. We bless your name. Father, we bless your name. Oh, we bless your name, for you're worthy, Lord, Lord, you're worthy, for you're worthy, you're worthy, you're worthy, oh, you're worthy, Lord, oh, you're worthy, Lord. Hi, Andre Healy, minister, pastor, how are you? Oh, we bless the name of the Lord God today. For the Lord God is great, and the Lord is greatly to be praised. In the name of Jesus, I thank you for coming in and joining me for our afternoon booster shot. I tell you, the Lord is moving. You know, you don't have to wait. Hallelujah. You don't have to wait for me to crack a scripture. You don't have to wait for me to prompt you. But don't you know right where you are, the spirit of the Lord is moving. The spirit of the Lord is moving upon you. He is moving up in your homes. He is doing what he said that he would.
would do is that when he said that he has blessed, he is already blessed. And he said that he would not revoke it and he cannot reverse it. He said, all you need to do is praise me. All you need to do is meditate upon the word. All you have to do is thank me for what I have already done. He said, the provision has already been made. He said, I have already blessed you in the name of Jesus. I need you to get in an agreement, hallelujah, with what the word of the Lord has said. This day, the spirit of the Lord is coming and he's moving. He's hovering up over you. I thank God today because in the beginning, hallelujah, when the world was dark, when the world was bleak, the Bible tells me that the spirit of the Lord, he hovered, he moved up over the face of the deep and whatever was missing, whatever was lacking, he began to speak to that area. So I am admonishing you today, whatever is lacking in your life, whatever is missing, whatever is broken, I pray God that you begin to speak to that area of your life. Whatever is, you know, is despair, whatever you have in your life that is causing you to be depressed, which is causing you to be oppressed, which is causing you to be in despair. But I thank God today because the word of the Lord says that when when those things happened in the beginning that God spoke and he spoke, he spoke, he spoke. Hear me today, somebody. I need you to speak to your situation. I need you to speak. I need you to be just like Abraham, who against hope he yet believed. Because I know that there are some things that you're going through. I know that there's some things that's in your life that it looks hopeless. But I know, and I'm reminded even when I think the prophet name was Jeremiah, when the Lord, no, it was Ezekiel. When the Lord came to him and he said, can these bones live? Can your situation live? Is it possible to live again? Is it possible to thrive again? Hallelujah. Is it possible? God is saying, and I'm here to answer that. And I say, yes, it is possible because all things are possible to you because what? You believe. Hallelujah. So if you have a situation, if you have a circumstance, if you have a pressing matter, if you have things where it looks like that you're backed up against the wall. But I'm here to tell you today, hallelujah, that come out of that corner. Come out of that corner in the name of Jesus because greater is he that's in you than he that is in the world. I'm here to remind you that the Calvary is here. I'm here to remind you that Jesus said just take a look. Just take a look. He said you look into the spirit and you will see that there is more for you and it is more that is with you than it is that is against you. For no weapon formed against you shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. I'm here today to tell you no weapon regardless to what the enemy brings, regardless to what he tries. I don't care if he tries to afflict your family members. I don't care if he even tries to afflict you. I don't care if he tries to touch your finances. I don't care if he tried to touch your property. I'm reminded of a scripture in the Bible or I'm reminded of a man in the Bible and his name was Job. Hallelujah. And I'm reminded that the enemy came and he touched everything that concerned him. But this is one thing I want you to hear out of that passage of Job. It said the thing that he feared the most came upon him. So I'm here today. Hey, they caught Rose. I'm here to tell you whatever is plaguing you, whatever has got you in fear, whatever has you in doubt, whatever has you in unbelief, I'm asking that the spirit of the Lord, that he goes down deep down in your heart, that he will help you and you will dislodge all fear. For God says, I have not given you the spirit of fear, but I have given you the power, the spirit of power, the spirit of power, the spirit of power, the spirit of love, the spirit of love, the spirit of love, the spirit of love power, and of a sound of mind. Hallelujah. So don't allow the enemy to make you think, hallelujah, that you can't make it. Don't allow that enemy to make you feel. Don't allow that enemy to make you want to give up, cave in, or quit. Hallelujah. say Hallelujah. Because as we praise God, you know how it is now. 
now when we praise God, hallelujah, the blessing of the Lord, he inhabits our praise. Don't you know God inhabits your praise? Don't you know God loves it when you praise his name? Oh, Tarase. Don't you know? Don't you know? Don't you know? Don't you know God loves to hear your praise? He didn't say you have to be a great singer. He didn't say you have to be a great psalmist. But he did say we can make a joyful noise unto the Lord. He said when you make melody in your heart, hallelujah, that he's tabernacling right there with you and not only that honey the spirit of the lord says he's moving on your behalf for when you pray in faith hallelujah when you sing in faith hallelujah when you make melody in your heart in faith hallelujah the lord says that he is watching over his word to perform it don't you know don't you know don't you know, don't you know, hallelujah. Don't you know, don't you know when you sing? Don't you know that's just like praying, hallelujah. Don't you know you've seen the word of the Lord? Whether you sing in the spirit or whether you sing in the natural, God hears. And not only does he hear, but he understands. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Oh, oh, God is moving. God is moving. Hallelujah. I need you to join in with me today. I need you to exercise your faith today. I need you to say, Father, I receive from you today. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hey. Oh, glory to God. Today is that day. This is the day that was spoken of by the prophet Joel that said, this is that time. Now, don't say, oh, somebody hear me. This is that. Whatever it is that God has promised you, I'm here to tell you. It is here. It is here. It is here. So whether you need, hallelujah, healing, whether you need salvation, whether it's your family member, I'm here today to remind Remind you that the Lord is not slack concerning his promise. Hallelujah. Oh God, you got me howling, howling, rock. Oh, you got me excited, Lord Jesus, because I want the excitement. I don't want you to be moved in your flesh, glory to God, but I want you to be moved in your spirit, man. You know when the spirit of the Lord comes. You know down in your inner man because your body, your spirit, it ought to be leaping, hot and hot. It ought to be just like Elizabeth when she met Mary and when they met each other, huh? The baby start to jump, honey. No, Paul. The baby needs to be jumping up in your womb. And what do you mean the baby? The promise of what God has said to you. That thing ought to be coming alive to you right now. It ought to be doing leaps and bounds up in your spirit. You ought to be strengthened in the Lord. You ought to be saying within your spirit that I can do all things through Christ Jesus that gives me the strength and the ability. Hit your likes. Hit your shares. Let everybody know, BWE, let them know that we're here today and we are declaring and we are decreeing the word of the Lord and the word of the Lord Lord says, behold, behold, behold. He says, I've made you, I've made you the head and not the tail. Hallelujah. I've made you a head of the head and not the tail, says the Spirit of the Lord. And he says, every place that the soles of your feet tread upon, God says, I've given you that territory. I've given you that territory. God says, every place that your feet tread upon, hallelujah, that he has given you that territory in the mighty name of Jesus. So you keep it moving, keep it moving, keep it moving in the name of Jesus. Don't stop, don't quit in the mighty name of Jesus. So if you thought by any whatever, if you thought by any chance that you was going down, I'm here to tell you that you are not going down because let me tell you this. Whew. 
The God that I serve does not seek. And if you got the word of God in you, the word will not seek. I'm reminded of his name, Peter. When they were out in the water, look at here. Some of you are so far out in the water. Some of you are so far out in the ocean. You have left the bank a long time ago. And all you see, oh, this is hot off the press for somebody. This is a rhema word for somebody. Some of you are so far deep in God. Some of you are so far away from the shore that you can't see. Everything around you, you see is water. Everything around you, you see is deepness. Everything you around you, you can't go back. You can't go to the side, you can't go to the left, you can't go to the right, and the only way for you to go is to keep it moving. But just like Peter, when the Spirit of the Lord showed up, listen here somebody, the Spirit of the Lord has showed up on your behalf today. The Spirit of the Lord has showed up, and Peter said, Lord, if that be you, hallelujah, bid me to come over to where you are. And all God said was, come. See, the Spirit of the Lord is saying unto you today, come, whatever it is that God promised you, you come, you meet God. He says, I've got my arms stretched out toward you today. Hallelujah. He says, when you draw nigh unto me, I'm drawing nigh unto you. I'm here to tell you that the Spirit of the Lord, he's got his arms stretched out. He said that he's got you. He's got you. He's got you in the palm of his hands. So Peter, he stepped out on faith. Some of you have stepped out in faith right now. He said, and as you begin to step out in faith, the winds begin to blow. The seas begin to roar. Many peoples in opposition start to come up against you. He said, and you took your eyes above the word of the Lord that said come, that said go, that said follow, whatever the word of the Lord was. He said, you took your eyes off and you began to look at what they were saying. You began to look at the circumstance, but then they begin to sink. Huh? And I know, but look Look at here, Jesus reached down and he picked him right back up and then he placed him on dry ground in the name of Jesus. Look at this. So what I'm saying to you, what I'm saying is that he was right there. He was right there. Hallelujah. He was right there in the midst of the water. He was right there in the midst of the circumstance. He was right there in the midst of the storm. He was right there. Hallelujah. What am I saying? He will never, ever, ever, never, ever, never, ever, never, ever will he leave you, nor will he forsake you. He will be with you even, even, even until the end of all time. Yes, he will. In the good time. In the bad time, in the fat time, in the lean time, whatever it is that you're going through in the Rathande, he says he will be there with you through it all. Many are the afflictions of the righteous, many tests and trials that you may go through. He said, but I will deliver you, I will deliver you, I will deliver you out of them all. Hallelujah. Oh, he said, out of them all. I will deliver. He promised me. He will deliver, deliver, deliver. Yes, he promised me. See, he promised you. And God is not a man that he shall lie. He is not a man that he will break his promises to you. Hallelujah. Has he not said and is he not able to do in the name of Jesus? Hallelujah. So today, I'm here just to remind you. Hallelujah. Oh, God, in the name of Jesus, you are not in this by yourself. <laughs> Pat, you say you a water walker. <laughs> yes, yeah, someone don't understand. That means that you out there. You on the water. You in the sea. You can't go back, but you're going to the end. Hallelujah. You're going to the end. Listen to me. Every last one of you, you're going to make it to the end. God says you will make it to the end, and he is daily perfecting that which concerns you. He will do it even until the day of Jesus Christ. So whatever it is, you will make it. 
you are making it. You have already made it in the spirit. Now we just need to get you there in the natural. Hallelujah in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you and I praise you. I thank you for this day. I thank you for this time that we have come together. Father, I thank you, God, that no weapon formed against your people shall prosper. I thank you, Lord God, that in the mighty name of Jesus, whatever has been held up, whatever the enemy is trying to cause delay in, I thank you now, God, that we bind that thing up now in the name of Jesus. And Father, we release the miracle working power of God, the anointing that destroys every yoke of the enemy. And Father, I release an immediate sudden season up over them right now in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you and I praise you that we're not moved by what it looks like at the present time because we know that what we see is temporal and we know God that it is subject to change in the name of Jesus and Father, it will change by the word of the Lord that we speak in Jesus' name. Now, Father God, I thank you because we're not wrestling against flesh and blood in the Rosek hair, but we're wrestling against principalities. We're wrestling against that dumb devil that's trying to cause them to give up or cave in or quit but in the name of Jesus but father I thank you right now that they're putting on the whole armor of God that they will be able to stand and they'll be able to withstand all the fiery darts of the enemy and now father as I pray I hear you in my spirit father I pray now a refreshing wind over them now father I pray now that the spirit of strength and the spirit of might hallelujah God, that you will infuse them like never before. Now, God, in the name of Jesus, Father, I thank you now. And I pray and I bind up that spirit of weariness. I pray and I bind up, I bind it up. Come on, come on, come on, get my mouth together. In the name of Jesus, that spirit of weariness, that spirit of timidness, that spirit of tiredness, that spirit of fatigueness, that spirit that just want to just cave in, give up and quit, that spirit that just want to say, I just want to go lay down and cover up my hands under the cover. You lying devil on that rosette. But God, I speak life to them because you said that you came that they would have a life and they would have life that more abundantly now, God. I hold you to your word, Lord. And I pray now, God, you said that when they've done everything that they know how to do, that they should stand and they will stand in readiness. They will stand, God, knowing that you will avenge them in Korande. I thank you right now, God, because you have said in the word of God that vengeance is mine and you shall repay in the mighty name of Jesus. Let no no say in the name of Jesus, hallelujah. We praise you for the victory right now, God, in Jesus' name. I praise your name, God. I praise your name, God. In the name, in the name, in the name. God is in your name, Jesus. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Help me praise him today. Help me praise him in the name of Jesus. When you praise him, your breakthrough is in your praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tamara, Tamara. I'm in an agreement with you today. For the Lord God is here. Listen to me now. The Lord God is here. All you need to do is be like the woman with the issue of the blood. She said, if I can just touch him. She said within herself, if I can just touch him. I need you now to reach out and touch him now, God. In the name of Jesus. Touch God today, right now. Tell God that you believe and you receive. Father, I thank you because they got on the whole armor of God. In the name of Jesus, help me praise him today, God. For this battle is not yours, says the Spirit of the Lord God. 
God. In Don Rasanea, he said, you don't need to fight in this battle. Hallelujah. Because this battle belongs to me, says God. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Break up in for it in the name of Jesus. Tia Harrison in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Laura Brown in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Pamela Brock in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Pat Pinneman in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Deborah Wade, Connie Daniels in the Nora Sunday. Calista Rice, Ikora Sunday. Desiree Reddick in the name of Jesus. Lorraine Rogers, Ikora Tama Sunday. Duando Rose, Danielle Evans, Huff, Ikora Sunday. Why did I do that? Because God said, encourage you. Every last one of you, Delta Base, every last one. One of you, Octavia Foundations, Rosie McGee, Indo Rose, Robin Anderson, Ruth Roberts, Kat Johnson, Cynthia Moon Spears, Inde Lolo Shunde, Asha Narayan, Ikurasa, Christina Alexander Crawford in the name of Jesus, Lily Davis, Indo Rose, Barbara Murphy, Ikuranda, Masunde, Le Kurande, say in the name, in the name, in the name, hallelujah, Laurencia de Leon. Every last one of you, hey, Miss Jackie, go right in the road, say, Atarama Babaha. Come on, somebody, come on, come on, come on. Felicia Edwards, in the name of Jesus, today is your day. Every last one of you, and every person I cannot name right now, oh God, I speak to the thousands right now. I tell you now, God, that in the Kuro say, in the name of Jesus, in the Kurabaka Sunday, receive the word of the Lord. Lord. Linda McKinney, Nicorande Cosea, Cynthia Wynn, Stacey Cassidy, Endo Rose, Joanne Itina, Kande Locura Sunday, and they receive, receive, receive. In the no, 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 drama Sunday, Sunday, Connie Daniels, Hallelujah, thank you, Jesus, Darlene Murray. Father, in the name of Jesus, Michael Jordan, and that I don't say Frank Ford, Tanya Harper. Father, I pray for each and every one of them. Teresa Blackwell, Father, and where? Brenda White, and Father, wherever. And even the spirit of discouragement. Father, I bind it up now, and we know that it is gone. And I pray now, and I release the spirit of peace, love, joy in the Holy Ghost. Alicia Estre, glory to God. Stacy Cassidy, in the name of Jesus. Donna Davidson. Oh, is that Regina Calcutt? In the mighty name of Jesus, Geraldine Cook. Crystal Julian Williams, hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, I hope you received of the Lord today. Because the Lord has come down. Reminds me, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. Here it is again, somebody. It reminds me of the word of the Lord, and this is the word of the Lord, and this is where we're going to end. It says that when the children of Babel, when they came on one accord, and they began to build a tower up to heaven, the Lord said that he came down in the midst of them. So I'm here to tell you today, hey, Stephen Martin, hallelujah. I'm here to say today, even Leslie Hicks, everybody, I'm here to tell you today that God said, because we came in on one mind in one accord in the spirit on this, the Lord's day, he said that he has come down. God said he has come down in the midst of your situation and he has moved. Hey, Miss Arlene, he has moved in the Rose. He's moved on your behalf. He said, because faith was in the earth, Gigi Vaughn, he said, faith was in the earth, faith was here, 12 noon, Sheila Moore, faith was here right now, 12 noon, in the name of Jesus, God is here and is moving 
and has moved on your behalf. <laughs> In the name of Jesus, I receive mine. Do you receive yours today? Do you receive yours? Hallelujah. Do you receive your blessing? Do you receive your breakthrough? Do you receive your anointing that will destroy every yoke of the enemy? Do you receive it today? I receive. I receive. I receive it right now, Teresa Victoria. In the Randa Hallelujah. Cat John said, I see it and God sees it. Oh, in the Rasa, whatever it is, everybody. Whatever it is, Joyce and Foster, we playing for Lester, every, whatever it is, somebody needs to know that whatever it is, whomever it is, whatever it is that you're praying for, God said it is done, it is done, it is done. Now you have to believe that it's done. Hallelujah. Now you have, now you have to believe that it's done. Hallelujah. Now you just got to say, Father, I thank you that it is done. Hallelujah. Don't be moved anymore by what you see. Just say, Father, I thank you that it is done. It is done. It is done. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. I thank you, God, that it is done. I is done. I is done. The Rondo will say, Ricky Henry. Father, I thank you and I pray for him now. I pray now, God, even for the fivefold ministry. God, I pray everything that we have already prayed that's in our spirit. God, everything that they're writing today, that is an act of their faith, God. And I thank you now that it is done. It is done. I lift them up, God. I lift up each and every one of them, God. And I pray the spirit of the Lord will move up over them. I pray now that the spirit of the Lord, God, Lord, will send that encouragement. He will send that wind. He will send it, God, and they will move upon them and they will know down in their inner man, God, how they do you have moved on their behalf. Tammy Little, we see you. Glory to God. Be encouraged, every pastor, every preacher, every evangelist, every teacher, every whatever uh, apostle, every prophet, Whatever part that you work in the fivefold ministry, whether you're in the ministry of health, Terry Tyndale, thank you, Jesus. God is moving on your behalf. Whatever part of the fivefold ministry that you operate in, whether it's the ministry of health, whether you are a greeter, whether you are an usher, or whether you are whatever you are in the body, whether you are a doorkeeper in the house of the Lord, whatever it is, God is pleased with your service and he is honoring that and moving on your behalf. Oh, Terry Holcomb, in the name of Jesus. Is a Terry or Tyree? Thank you, Jesus, that you receive it in the name of Jesus. There you go, Miss Regina. Receive now. It's not because of what Pastor Sharana said, but it's because the Spirit of the Lord is speaking through me to you, and now you just receive. Tell Father God that I receive it and tell him that it is done. So don't worry anymore. Don't fret anymore. In the name of Jesus. We out of here. <laughs> Woo! In the name of Jesus. Come on, somebody. He promised me. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. He will deliver, deliver, deliver. Yes. He promised me. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. He promised. And because he promised, he will deliver. He said he is not slack concerning his promise. And whatever he promised, that will he do. In Jesus' name, I love you. Dr. Jackie loves you. Our CEO and founder, who is Dr. Jacqueline King, loves you. Our overseer, who is Apostle Dr. Oscar Underwood, we love you. Every ministry gift here at VWE, VME, every facet of whatever you do, what our capacity that you serve in, I honor you. God loves you. We thank you. I am Pastor Sharon, and I will be back again on Wednesday. I'm here every Wednesday, 6.30 a.m., every Thursday, 12 noon, as God permits. I am here to be with you. So make a commitment to be here with us together. And if you know someone else, 
Have them commit to 6.30 a.m. Have them commit to 12 noon. Why? Because the spirit of the Lord is here. And when the spirit of the Lord is, there is unity in the name of Jesus. So hallelujah. Hi, Miss Tanya. Thank you, Jesus. So where the spirit of the Lord is, Kendra Woods, it is God. Wherever the spirit of the Lord is, that's where we need to be. And hallelujah, I love being in the spirit of the Lord. I love being with the spirit of the Lord. And I love being with you. And I hope you will do the same. I hope you love being with us, being with me during our time together. Hey, you know this? I'm so glad we had this time together. <laughs> Y'all remember that? Just to have a little, what, sing a song or something. But before you know it, it comes to time that we have to say. So long. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Father, I just thank you for my sisters. I thank you for my brothers, God. I thank you today because today is that day that you made. And not only did you make it, God, that you are blessing them in this day. The best is coming to them this day. Today, God, you've released the manifold blessing up over them right now. In Jesus' name, amen. Until next week, Wednesday, I will see you. Amen. God bless you and I love you. I am Pastor Sharon and I will talk to you soon. Praise the Lord in Jesus' name. Amen.